the Oryx throne lies somewhere in this haunted realm. It's time to return his wretched soul. Bukathos favors me. The warmth of life has no place among the damned. couldn't kill her. But you... You can still catch her, if you're quick about it. Uh, you're wounded. Let me help you. No. If she escapes because of me, I won't be able to live with myself. Go! Now! It is done, Lethys. You will never have the Oryx soul. You're right. I won't. Instead, allow me to demonstrate what this stone can do in the right hands. My hands! I need more time. Lethys escaped then. She never was the type to put her life on the line. What? No. We just fought. I... I killed her. Did you now? And yet, dead people tend to leave corpses. They certainly don't explode into bloody mist. They sort of just... Uh, crumple. Nobody... Not dead. I will have to follow after her. Regardless, I must thank you for your aid, my friend. Blessings of Rathma upon your journey, wherever it may take you. All this suffering over a single shard. Hopefully Elder Cain has found a way to destroy them once and for all. Now... Let's see if this scroll of Westmarch he gave me actually works. Adventurer! Over here! Ha! Huh. I knew it had to be you. Been waiting a while for you to show. Charcy would have stayed, but, you know, she's got business to run. Uh, I'm sorry. Who is Charcy? How do you know me? Oh, forgive me. <laughs> I got a little overzealous there. Let's say we all have a mutual friend. A certain 
scholar who arrived before you did? Our friend asked us to greet you when you arrived. Listen, Chas is the one you want to speak with. Find her at the blacksmith, and she'll guide you further. Welcome to Westmarch, and good luck. Excuse me. Are you Charcy? A man on the bridge implied you could help me find Deckard Kane. It's you! You're here! Kane is gonna be so happy you arrived. Well, let me be among the first to welcome you to Westmarch. <laughs> Isn't it as grand as the stories say? It is uh, certainly large. I will give it that. Uh, where might I find Elder Kane? Oh, <laughs> right, of course. Kane has a workshop over to the left of the central square, just beyond the fountain. You know, once I've finished up here, I'll join you two. Give you a proper introduction to the city. Goodbye. Welcome, friend. Welcome. I am glad to see you made it here safely. And with the shard of the world stone, I hope? Of course. Can we destroy them? Well done, my friend. I am certain it was no easy task to acquire this shard. Sadly, there is no simple answer on how to destroy an object this powerful. For now, it must be kept out of sight. Now then, you may recall I spoke of a ritual that revealed the world stone shards in Wortham and Ashwold. Well, while you were busy, so was I. And Tal Rasha's ritual has revealed a third stone to me. You see, the ritual cannot simply find all the shards across the world. No, it reveals those that are being used in some form. It seems the magic of the world stone emanates from the dark wood, a place of great and ancient evil. So, the shard is already in someone's hands, then? Unfortunately, yes. You must expect that the darkness is already moving against you. But you are not alone. In fact, Charcy should be here soon. I can think of no one better to help you find the strength you will need. Really? Let me see it. I used to be quite adept at revealing the properties of magical equipment, you know. Ah, yes. The grooves of this weapon function as sockets. Some rare armors and weapons can be befitted with gems of legendary power. There's research on it around here. If you can find it in the mess. I'll have a look around. Legendary gems seem very useful. How would one go about acquiring them? Well, the writings I've seen speak of the Elder Rift in the same breath as these gems. Legends upon legends, it seems. Still, 
I believe the royal mages recently made a breakthrough involving something called crests. You're done already. I would have thought destroying world stone shards would take more time than that. Mm, you're not wrong there. And it appears I must find another in the dark wood. Kane mentioned you might be able to help out. The dark wood? <sighs> you know, I grew up not far from there. Hmm. If you're heading to a place like that, you're gonna need some better equipment. I know what to do. Excuse me. I had heard a rumor that there's been a breakthrough with the Elder Rift. You strike me as someone who might know a thing or two about it. You've got a sharp eye, adventurer. The court mages have been testing out various crests of power for a while now. We've just been given permission to start selling them. Only to qualified individuals, of course. From the look of you, I think we might be able to do business, friend. What do you say? The first crest's on me. We have an accord, then. Head over to the pedestal and place that crest into one of the recesses there. From what the mages tell me, that should activate the Elder Rift. Good luck in there. High heaven, someone finally survived! <laughs> I knew you were the right one. It's, tell me, what was it like in there? Maze-like corridors filled with untold horror as expected. I did find a few valuable things. Uh, hold on. Did you say finally survived? Valuable things, huh? Oh, I like the sound of that. Business is going to be booming once rumor of ancient treasures starts to circle around the city. Here, you more than earned these, friend. Have a few more crests on the house. Who knows what you'll find in there next time, huh? Hells, if you find something nice enough, you might even be able to make some decent platinum at that market in Rackers Square to the south. Take a gander if you get the chance. It'll be worth your time, I promise you that. Are you all right? Can you walk? Ooh. Oh, yes, I think I'm fine. Thanks to the both of you. I may need some help getting back to my shop, however. Oh. We've got you. Vic's shop isn't too far from here. Akarat, bless the both of you. Adventurer, I don't think it's a good idea for me to carry these gems any longer. Please, take them to my workshop and, and let my apprentice know we'll be there soon. Oh, hello! Uh, combining, socketing... Master Vic? Is he all right? Usually his cart has arrived by now. He was attacked. 
<clears throat> but he's going to be fine. Charcy is bringing him here now. He asked me to guard these gems until he arrived. Oh, the shipment's safe. Thank the high heavens. We would have been in a lot of trouble if that hadn't arrived. You're a real lifesaver, friend. Oh, I will tell I... you all. Oh, I have oh, never been gladder to be home. Thank you, Charcy. And you, my new friend. The both of you are welcome in this shop anytime. Ah, I see you met with my apprentice, Cyril. Good. If you ever need to socket gems or craft more powerful varieties, come here and she can help you out. For a small fee, of course. We're not a charity. <laughs> well, it's time we got going. Stay safe, okay, Vic? And maybe don't carry so many gems on you next time? An evil air permeates this forest. I had best find this priestess Akara quickly. Help! Get this thing off me! <laughs> Friend, come closer. My, my daughter, she's still in the village. Please, you have to save her. I will try. Can you tell me what happened here? These women in black armor, they attacked the town. They summoned these terrible vines. I tried to warn the sisterhood, but I... Here. It's all in this letter. Bring it to Commander Kasha. Go. Leave me. J just save... Alyssa. A blood trail. Please don't be the girl. Hmm. Too old to be the man's daughter. The body is cold, drained of blood. What could have done this so quickly? Clothing and another emaciated body. The vine was feeding on the corpse. They're draining this village of its blood. Why? Someone help! Please! I can't open the door! Father! Are, are you there? A voice! Alyssa, I have to get there now. Still recharging. Heard a noise. Who's out there? Alyssa, I'm going to get you out of there. friend your father he didn't listen your village is under attack we have to get you out of here now leave no i'm not leaving my father told me to stay hidden he promised to get me to safety he's going to come back he has to Alyssa, your father is dead his last request was for me to save you and to deliver this letter to someone called Kasha. You and I can still bring it to her together. You really did see him, didn't you? Dad. You're, you're right. We have to go. I can take you to the Sisterhood's camp. Kasha will know what to do. All right. But stay close. 
We are still in grave danger. It comes this way. Follow me. Get back! Let me fight them! You will bleed! I need energy! Are you alright? Did she hurt you? No! No, I'm okay! I'm sorry, I didn't know what to do! They killed my father! Everyone in my village! And then she was standing right there, taunting me, like I was nothing. You are not nothing. We will ensure those women pay for what they did, I promise. But we must leave here and find Kasha. Help! The vines have me! Do not fear. We will fight back these traitors together. No time to rest yet, stranger. More are coming. Is that all of them? Yes, but remain alert. We are close to their den. My rogues and I will continue the pursuit. Oh. <laughs> No. Oh, gods, forgive me. I am so sorry, child. A cruel fate for one so young. I knew the girl's father. And since you were with her, I take it he did not survive either. You are no villager. Who are you? Why are you here? I am a child of Bulkathos. I came here seeking a priestess, and have found only carnage and loss. You must be Kasha. Then this letter is yours. The Let me see it, Outlander. Hmm. Lucian was right to be afraid. These Bloodsworn, as they call themselves, are traitors to the Sisterhood of the Sightless Eye. This is not the first atrocity they have committed. Sadly, Blackstone is gone. And like with this poor girl, there is no one doing the terrible loss of life. But we can avenge the fallen and prevent further misery. My Alyssa, no. A cruel fate for one so young. I am a child of- Let me see it, Outlander. Hmm. Lucian was right to be afraid. These Bloodsworn, as they call themselves, are traitors to the Sisterhood of the Sightless Eye. This is not the first atrocity they have committed. Sadly, Blackstone is gone. And like with this poor girl, there is no one doing the terrible loss of life. But- we can avenge the fallen and prevent further misery. My rogues and I are going to put an end to these bloodsworn. Join us. Commander, Lakri's forces ambushed us. The bloodsworn retreated into the overgrown village, but our numbers are too few to pursue. And the wounded. Flavi, order the rogues to pull back. Get the injured to the battle camp, and bury the dead. My new friend and I will be the ones pursuing Lockry from here. As for you, Outlander, it appears you have the honor of heading in first. Once Flavi and I have ensured the safety of our sisters, and recovered the bodies of those who've been lost, I will join you. 
Considering you fought your way through that village, I doubt you will miss me too severely. Go. Show those traitors that death is the only mercy we will afford them. Gladly. I will see you inside, Kasha. Still recharging. Friend, I beseech you, free me of these vines. Thank you. I did not expect much kindness was left in these woods. Not since the Bloodsworn began their vile hunt. You're welcome, cousin. It is rare to see a druid so far from Skazglen. What did these wretches want with you? They were torturing me. Wanted me to join their perverse cause. That scene you saw outside. They want to spread that corruption through the woods. A druid would sooner die than aid in such a thing. <laughs> in fact, I almost did. Kasha, you missed the excitement. Lockery and her retinue captured this druid. He's been injured. Yes, he's lost a lot of blood. Our friend here will not survive long without treatment. Someone will have to stay with him. I have gotten this far on my own. What's a little further? You outlanders seem to love surprising me. Fine. Very well. Go and deal with Lockery. Once the deed is done, meet us back at the camp. May the Great Eye watch over you. Mistress, I've done as you asked. The blood of every man, woman, and child in Blackstone runs through your veins. Yet it is not enough. I must be whole once more. Hasten your efforts, lest you lose my favor. Cut his new pet. She'll discard you too, if you live. I'm injured. I'm here. The true ruler of this land is returning. Her dominion is absolute. has always belonged to her. She will ensure you remember those you have forgotten. Lockery escaped. Kasha will need to know about this. You there. Where is Kasha? Oh, she, uh, she left for the battle camp a while ago. Had a druid in tow. Bleeding everywhere, that one was. Hopefully the priestess can see to his wounds. Head east through the woods to find the camp, but be careful. Demons plague this forest. Leave me alone, you monsters! Thank you for your help. The Fallen have grown much more aggressive as of late. Kosha asked me to wait for you. Uh, I'm... Glad you came along when you did. Uh, I'm Lien, by the way. Huh. You're welcome, Lien. Do you know where I can find the battle camp of the Sisterhood? It's not far. Keep going down this road and you'll find Kosha inside the camp. Oh, and maybe you can kill a few more Fallen on the way. That would really help us out. Ah, you've returned. I trust you bring news of victory. Some. The Bloodsworn were driven from the village. 
but Lockry escaped. I see. Still, you've done well. This was never truly your fight, Outlander. If I remember, you came to this land in search of Akara, yes? It is time the two of you met. Go to her. And show respect, hmm? She may be the High Priestess of the Sisters of the Sightless Eye, but she is also like a mother to me. Oh, and don't fret about Lockery. My rogues and I will handle her. Priestess Akara, it is an honor. I've come with a dire request. Elder Cain and Charcy believed you could help us find a Worldstone shard hidden in these woods. A shard of the Worldstone? Interesting. That certainly could be the source of our troubles. It seems the Great Eye has aligned our goals, my friend. As you have undoubtedly seen, the Dark Wood suffers at the hands of the Bloodsworn. Their leader, Lakri, was once part of the Sisterhood, until her heart was broken. She rejected us and found someone else to accept her. Worldstone Shard could be the source of the new power they have acquired. And if that is the case, you will need all the assistance I can offer. Years ago, Deckard Cain left me with a gift, a tome of Herodric origin. In truth, its strange magics were never meant for me. How fitting that he has sent you here to complete the circle. On your way to this camp, you killed several of those fallen demons, did you not? Their essence swirls about you. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, the tome is surely meant for you. Follow me if you would. The Horodric Bestiary is yours. As you defeat the monsters of this world, their essence will provide you both strength and knowledge. When you have collected enough essence, Bring the tome to one of these altars, and you will be greatly rewarded. Now then, we must return to the task at hand. If you are to find your world stone shard, you will need help. Thankfully, we are not alone in this endeavor. Let us speak with your wounded friend. Hemlia, your rescuer has returned. Ah, you're back. <laughs> good, good. I didn't get a chance to introduce myself while I was choking to death in those vines. My name is Hemlia, and I... Well, I suppose I owe you my life. Don't I? It was the least I could do. Still, I am curious. What brought you here? The Dark Wood is quite a distance from your home. Aye, tis. And how I miss Tuodulra. But the corruption of nature in these lands cannot be ignored. I came here to commune with the great tree Hinifus, and it was there that I was captured. The dead tree teems with old magic. The bark whispered to me of a way to cleanse this corruption. Unfortunately, the ritual is complicated, and I lack the strength to gather the resources. Uh, but perhaps you can help there. We must acquire native reagents. A crimson arax giant eye, a thorn from the largest of those blood flowers, and a branch of the darkest wood. Combined, the forest itself will reveal the truth to us. Now, the spider's eye and the thorn should be simple. Both can be found to the north. But the branch, well, 
The oldest trees here are where fallen make camp. Maybe we start with the other two, eh? Cavern to the north. Yes. This looks exactly like the place a giant spider would hide. Blood flowers thorn. Henry seemed to think it was close. Perhaps these wretched vines will lead me to it. The vines grow thicker to the west. I must be nearby. There we are. Where there is a blood flower of that size, there are surely thorns. So the obedient hound of the usurpers barks at my door at last. Matharisi, show this mongrel what it means to be slain to the blood. Go kill or die for me! I need more time. Everything is mine. Even your victories hasten my return. These lives you value are a lie built upon the remains of my kingdom. The blood flowing in their veins is stolen. I will have it back. Only suffering awaits you if you continue on your path. And you lack the strength to bear such loss. The thorn is mine, coated in the blood of the enemy. Hemlir spoke of a branch of dark wood. The largest trees are to the south. I should start there. That rumbling. Something is coming. <laughs> I need more time.
Salvaging for Thank you for the coin, friend. <laughs> You've done it. <laughs> oh. Exhale. I don't understand. What happened? Did we get something wrong? No, no. The ritual should have worked. Each piece represents a part of the Dark Wood's condition. The flames should have revealed their connection. We are missing something. Akara, we could use your help. Could you now? It is nice to know that even at my age, my insight is still appreciated. Yes, a woman. Her wicked desires have perverted the nature of these woods. Only a magic equally as dark can bind your ritual. We would be blind without your wisdom, Akara. Well, if we're seeking out dark magic, I know exactly where to look. On my way to the Great Tree, I encountered a camp of cultists. They've been scouring the woods, looking for something. If we're seeking a source of dark magic, that's the place we're going to find it. Very well. I'll return soon. Ha! No need to keep running around. Just meet at the Tree of Innovus. With all four components, we should be able to fight back this corruption. Oh, before you go, I asked Hess to make something for you. But you need to grab it yourself. I am still recovering, after all. Salvaging, forging, how do it all? There you are. Just finished this beauty up. Here, all yours. Sure makes me wonder what old Hemler imagines is waiting for you out there, though. Whatever it is, this ought to come in handy. Come on back if you need something. are the same ones who attacked Wortham. They must also be seeking the shard. Your master wishes to speak. The fragment of the eye. The world is done. And you shall have whatever your heart desires. My heart only desires one thing. And your precious fragment is hers. Deliver the stone, or the burning hells will cleanse this world. Mistress in If you had such power, you'd be taking the stone, not asking for it. You have your answer. With the stone's power, even hell cannot stop her. and I will need to work together to face such power. An ember of the burning hells. 
It smolders with dark magic. I hope it will be enough. To the tree, then. The blood sworn are attacking. Hemlia, hold fast! I'm coming! You're all right? Good. Uh, for a moment there, I feared the worst. And with good reason. The damned Bloodsworn are giving us precious little time to waste. Still, you are able to get the final component, so not all is lost. Now, this ritual will bridge my consciousness to the tree and the forest beyond. This magic is chaotic, ancient, the kind that scars the soul. Can I count on your protection, friend? Do what you must. I will keep you safe. There, at the tree! Just as Lockery said! Kill them! Don't have enough energy. Bone Kothos dies my head. Guiding my sight. I see the darkness infecting this land. An evil that has festered in the deep places. It corrupts life, feeds off it like a parasite. Hemlier, your face, it's. We have to stop this. Did I not warn this kind of magic scars? <laughs> no, we cannot stop. The ritual awakened the power bound within the tree. It wants to be free. It will help us fight the corruption for a price. You have your bargain, Inifus. Banish the corruption infecting this wood and its people, as promised. What's happening? It should have worked. Wait! It's inside me! Pulling the corruption out! Friend, you must destroy it. It can be purged. No, not yet. Not enough energy. I am weak. Is it over? It is, but there is no cause for celebration. The forest will not be purged so easily. Not while the heart of its corruption remains. I could see it all now, friend. And it is terrible to behold. A blight seeps from the forgotten tower. At its roots, 
lies a woman in a pool of stolen blood. Around her neck, a red stone pulses with a power older than the world itself. The vines whisper to me. They tell me of an abomination, a blood rose. Through the rose, the blood flows to her, feeds her. It must be cut down. I have to alert the sisters of a sightless eye. You will have your chance. The plants tell me a rogue is on her way here now. Enough. We're getting you out of here. No, you're not. Not if you wish to survive this. We've been given a chance, but we must strike now. Kill the Blood Rose. As long as it feeds her blood, the Countess cannot die. And this corruption will never end. The tree can purge your lingering corruption, but for now... The rogues need you. Flavi? Hemlier just... Wait, why are you here? What's happened? Haven't you heard? Kasha led a war party to attack the Forgotten Tower. I was returning to the encampment to rally the others when I saw what was happening here. I'm only sorry I arrived too late to help you. There's nothing you could have done. <laughs> Hold! Did you say the rogues are attacking the tower? Yes. And the Bloodsworn are fighting ferociously. Kasha sent me to ask Akara for aid. Damn. The Countess cannot die while the Blood Rose lives. Your sisters are walking into a trap. I must reach Akara and the others, lest the Bloodsworn take them as well. Head to the Rose and we can join you there. May the Great Eye watch over us both. Lien, you're hurt. Who did this? Where is Lakri? <laughs> blood. The rose is drinking their blood. It has the others. I barely got away. Gods above! Listen, Lien. I'm going in there, and I'm going to kill that thing. But you will not survive if you come with me. Flavi is sending reinforcements. Hide and wait for them. Stay hidden, and I will return as soon as I'm able. All right? Keep going. Do what you need to. I'll try. I'll try. Someone's approaching. Feed their corpse to the rose! Both your bloody rose and your mistress die tonight. This abomination is what feeds the Countess. Well then, monstrosity, your end has come. I don't have enough energy.
I should slay you where you stand, but I'm no fool. I will not chance losing and failing her again! No, no, no. She entrusted her blood to me, a gift to ensure her beautiful world came to fruition. It will be enough. But I can't have you interfering! Stand there and witness your failure! My mistress, I give back all that you bestowed upon me. Take everything! My life, my blood, is yours. Let me serve you forever! Damn you, Lakri. will no longer poison the land. The Countess is vulnerable. Now is the moment to strike at the heart of the Forgotten Tower. Lien. Hemlir. Lien. Dozens of our sisters, all of them have laid down their lives to prevent evil from returning. We cannot allow such sacrifices to be in vain. The Blood Rose is dead, but Lakri gave up her life before I could stop her. The Countess is returning. Then she must be slain. There is no other course. No other way. An evil like that cannot possess an artifact like the heart of creation. It will not be easy. But you must act as the heroes of Sanctuary did. Join Kasha and the others at the Forgotten Tower and end the curse upon this land. The magic of the waypoint here will make your journey faster. Go, friend. This world depends on your task. May the Great Eye watch over us all.
Beauty fades. It is impossible to escape. I will not submit to this truth. I am beyond the pitiful laws of tiny men. Their blood will serve me. Fulfill my purpose. My splendor. Reborn from their pain. And my beauty will never fade again. The tower is just beyond the courtyard. I can smell the stench of blood from here. No! I will not fade again. She... she's dead? It's over. Come, let us return to the tower's entrance. It is done, and you are triumphant where we faltered. That is twice now I have misjudged an outlander. Hmm, I suppose I may need to work on that. That object in your hand, is that? A shard of the world stone? Uh, yes. Its terrible power resurrected the Countess. I will trust both you and Cain to deal with it then. I'm sure he'll be relieved to know it is in your capable hands. In the meantime, we will continue to ensure the Bloodsworn do not return. Should you ever require our aid, we will be here. Farewell, friend. There you are. Come, stay a while. The two of us have much to discuss, I'm certain. Indeed, Kane. Once again, you were right. The shard was already in the hands of evil when I arrived. Many laid down their lives to aid us in reclaiming it. Such sacrifice. Each shard has only fallen into worse hands. It is far past time we were rid of them. Follow me, if you would. Even as small as they are, the shards still radiate a corrupting power. There. It should be safe enough to begin the ritual. Strange. The spell seems to have no effect. It is as if the stones are resisting. I should have guessed this would not be easy. Even the ancient Herodrim worked together when dealing with shards of the world stone. My friend, I will need you to lend me your strength if we are to attempt the ritual once again. Can I count on you? What must I do? Stand there, outstretch your arms, and focus your mind upon the stones. The rest will be up to me. Never rush a child to Pocapos.
No, not yet. I need energy. Kane, are you hurt? I'm fine. But that... that was not supposed to happen. The shards have been irrevocably corrupted by Bale's influence. I'm sorry, but... I am truly at a loss. No. No. Despair will do us no good. There must be an answer somewhere. There always is. But I will need to consult the Herodric texts. And that will take some time. Do not lose hope, Cain. I'm sure you will find something. <laughs>